Hey guys, what is up? My name is Ian, welcome to Brokenomics. Today I'm gonna to go through a quick price and token analysis of the Flow token. Uh, before I do, just a quick shill, please click the like button if you enjoy the content, and if you're a returning viewer especially and you watch lots of our content, please click subscribe as it really helps us out a lot in terms of growing the channel. Um, so why pick now to look at the Flow token? Well, it's a really important month for Flow. In the release schedule or table that you can see, on screen now uh, we're at month 12 where month uh, the first month october 16th last year was month zero so that means as you can see we're going from a circulating supply of 72 million up to 315 million now that's almost four and a half times the amount of flow tokens in circulation you can see that 175 million of these are coming from the ico and earlier backers now, to put that in context, that ICO option was at $0.10. Cent. Price is now around the $19 mark as we speak. They're up 190x on their tokens with a maximum investment of 1000 So some pretty serious money there from a relatively small investment. And the people in from the earlier backing rounds that unlock are obviously in at a lower price again. So even bigger gains to be realized. And you can imagine that profit taking uh, will be something that's done. Um, you can see as well that 25 million tokens are coming from the Dutch auction that they held. Uh, again, serious profits to be taken there and some from the team and development uh, that would have been, I guess, given their tokens or would have been part of their packages for employment in Flow. So Flow is a project, obviously, that has just, you know, knocked it out of the park. They've got the NBA Topshop partnership. They have the NFL coming up, uh, the UFC collectibles on Flow as well. Uh, has been something that I signed up for early access for. So really a project that's delivering. I've interacted with the blockchain uh, using Topshot. It's very quick, easy to do. You get your NFTs or your uh, your balance back very quickly. Um, so long term, something we're definitely bullish on, something that one of the guys uh, on the team here at Brokenomics, Robin, bought at ICO stage. But short term, given that unlock, uh, is something certainly to be concerned over. But perhaps uh, we can find some solace when we look at the chart and reasons to be bullish on flow short term, because I think it's a project that we're all bullish on long term, but it's the short term coming up. And also the opportunities that this unlock might present uh, to actually build a position in flow, because if a supply shock does come in, uh, certainly levels lower down are things we might want to be watching to build up a position and average our way into you know what is a, a, an absolutely stellar project and just quickly if you are interested in icos idos nft drops and getting on white lists uh, check out our telegram we got a great community in there of people who really help each other out and a calendar as well with all of the things i mentioned in it to help you keep on top of opportunities in the market so Speaking of the market, uh, if we look at the market for flow, uh, what I have in this chart is a volume weighted average price from the all time high, another one from the failed attempt at the all time high a month later, another volume weighted average price from the all time low, uh, and the volume weighted average price uh, anchored is just since that point, here is the average price paid by volume. So it's representative of the average participant in the market now are they making money or are they down money and you can see with price being below all these levels um, the average participant since even the all-time low is actually down money uh, and obviously the highs as well um, we also have a 50-day moving average a five-day moving average uh, in the green and a potential uh, trend line uptrend line here that could be forming uh, so definitely, you know, something I'll keep an eye on uh, as I watch the chart going forward. One reason to be bullish, I suppose, is we've just broken above a uh, flat to hopefully soon rising five day moving average. But you can see above, I mean, we've got the volume weighted average price from the low, the failed attempt at the all time high, a declining 50 day moving average, static resistance at around just below $21 and the volume weighted average price from the all time high all kind of within a couple of dollars of where we are now we also have obviously uh more resistance at 25 dollars and in terms of support really uh given price history we don't really have that much on the daily time frame at least until we get down towards the 15 dollar level and uh, not including this trend line so with the unlock coming um it does present that opportunity for people to get involved and perhaps 
uh, this trend line, uh, the $15 level, maybe even down as low as 1170, where we saw some previous price action spikes and another touch here, uh, are levels that I might look to fill a position in flow because as I say, it is something I'm bullish about long term, but uh, that unlock just makes me incredibly nervous. So just some levels of interest for you to watch out for. Guys, if you enjoy the content before you leave, please click like and subscribe. Uh, we bang out you know, good quality research very regularly on ICOs, IDOs, NFT opportunities, try to keep you on top of stuff. So yeah, hope you enjoyed the vid and uh, good luck.